Okay, we're here at uh, Gaviota State Beach, a uh, really cool beach. Here, this is uh, um, just near where the 101 bends in to go, to go inland towards Santa Maria. So here we are, we see um, all kinds of interesting historic um, stuff going on here. We have the train trestle, the train tracks that have been here since the uh, mid-late 1800s. Um, we have an estuary here, a, a, a creek, freshwater source that um, dumps out on the beach and when it's flowing and or high tide, as you can tell from the, um, from the very wet sand here, this, this is a direct connection with the ocean. So we have an, an estuarine condition here. We have some rocky bench here. Um, and we also have a, a nice little uh, flat beach, relatively steep beach. We're talking about a seven, eight uh, percent face right here. Um, there's a campground back in there. There's actually a store. Normally you don't have, don't have stores at some of our beaches, but there's a concessionaire. Um, we, and then of course we have the pier. So the pier is where we can launch small boats and, and other things. If folks need to get up to the, the area here west of us and north of us up the coast, this is a, this is a put in point if you have a, a boat that um, uh, needs a launch. Out in the distance, you may, may, may or may not be able to see it, but out in the distance we have some oil rigs. So we have the, the Santa Barbara Channel oil production going on. Um, and generally uh, some good kelp here, generally some good offshore reefs here. And that's leading to a good amount of productivity coming in here. And so therefore some rack on the beach, even though there's a lot of visitors here that are messing with the rack, you can still see that the rack line is quite present. Um, uh, a popular place for families, you can see there's, there's shells and all that kind of stuff hanging out here. Um, very cool. Uh, clams and, and whelks and uh, kellets, whelk and good stuff. Uh, and then we have some of the, the driftwood that we normally have coming, coming down and coming up the coast here. And there's enough that the kids can make some structures, play structures, etc. with. We have a lifeguard tower, so it's a relatively safe beach if people want to bring their um, elderly or young members of their family here and, and play a little bit at the beach, that's great. There's also a lot of fishing that goes on here. So um, instead of seeing surfers like we typically see, one of the user communities here we have, um, which tends to fall in the extractive category, um, are fishermen. So there's a lot of fishermen that are using their kayaks, and so they're going from their kayaks uh, offshore and then floating out there and then fishing and, and leaving their poles uh, in, uh, in holders as they sort of chill out for the day on their kayaks. So piers, bridges, campgrounds. Um, this is a, a multi-use area uh, here in Santa Barbara County on this nice uh, July morning that's still fairly uh, overcast and no sky July day happening.